The next morning at eight o'clock, stage one of the rest began. The stunning lands landscape of sand dunes, rocky climbs, bare mountains, canyons, and volcanoes gave Zambi the motivation he needed. So what happened? The next morning, their running was about to take place at 8 o'clock. Okay, in the morning, stage one was about to begin. Now, the stunning, there were like so many things, okay, that was, you know, like uh, that was giving him, that, were, that was motivating Zambi to take part in this race, okay? Now, he was very much interested to take part in this race because of the reasons. The, um, one of the reasons you can see in the textbook, the stunning landscape of sand dunes, okay? So, the beautiful scenery. Landscape means the scenery, okay? The scenery of sand dunes. I will show you the picture of sand dunes. Rocky climbs, okay? The, uh, the, this, the things that they were about to cross okay the the things are like on the, the place where they were about to run okay so on rocky climbs bear mountains mount like bear mountains means without any trees canyons again can canyons even i will show you the picture and volcanoes now this all things together it was motivating sitampi to take part in the race okay he was very like he was very excited okay being a uh, pink flags marked a race route through breathless climbs and pounding descents. So, pink flags, there were pink flags, okay, marked, okay, um, marked on each route, okay, so that this pink flags would help the runner, okay, to know which route to run, which which path to take, okay, on which path they have to run. So, with the help of the pink flags, the runner were able to find out their route. And like while running, they were breathless, but let me see, whenever, whenever we run, for continuously for some time then we become heart breathless right we like our breath becomes very fast and and so even same thing uh Sitambi, he was having breathless climbs means they have to climb mountains so when they were climbing the mountains they were breath they were breathing very faster and harder and pounding the sense pounding means so like after climbing mountains again they have to get down the hill okay they have to get down the mountain so when they were getting down the mountain again the heart were bounding okay bound means the beating of the heart okay now the temperature soared to above 40 degrees celsius in the daytime and dropped to around 5 degrees celsius at night so what happened during the daytime we know it's a hot like during the daytime it's a very it's like the temperature is very hot and during the nighttime it becomes very Cold. Now here you would see the picture of sand tunes. Okay, I will show you. Can you see? Now this is called sand tunes. Okay, now you got it. And also I will show you the next picture that is. This is what it called by canyons. Okay, canyon means rocky stones. Okay, S like uh, a narrow like stream flowing through rocks okay through big rocks so this is what we call canyons let's continue with the next paragraph stage do begin with an eight kilometer run so the first stage was done okay now this is stage two it was the runner had to run eight kilometer through a deep river canyon now canyon you have seen the picture right so the runner had to run through like they have to go through a deep river canyon which brought them to an old mountain road so after running uh, through the deep canyon the runner okay they came to an old mountain road okay and road on the mountain okay which was very old and an ancient foot bridge and also there was a foot bridge which was very like which belonged to the past okay ancient means old okay a very old foot bridge which was believed to be an to be of Inca vintage. Now, Inca means it's an empire, okay, a ruler, okay, uh, from Peru, okay. So, this uh, this footbridge believed to be from the Inca vintage, means from the rulers, those rulers, okay, who were, uh, who were ruling the, who were ruling the place, who were ruling, uh, ruling the kingdom, they were called the Inca, okay, and they belong, uh, they belong to Peru, okay. Now, this Inca vintage means, vintage means things, okay, like all things, okay, 
very old things which are very precious and are of very high quality okay so this foot bridge was from the inca vintage the next 9.6 kilometer was a steep climb through scenic areas which which the runner had little time to appreciate now the next 9.6 kilometer they had to run 9.6 kilometer and that very kilometer run okay it was a steep climb okay they have to climb very high and um through like when they were climbing high they were crossing by very beautiful places okay very beautiful viewpoint okay but the runners had no time to admire the beautiful scenery at the end of the stretch at the end of the nine uh, after running the 9.6 kilometer they came to a ridge from where they could see a volcanic mountain range dominating the horizon with wispy smoke rising from the peaks so at the end of like as they came to the ridge after running through that nine point uh, steep uh, like through that very uh, nine point six uh, kilometer run they came to a place okay f from where they could see a volcanic mountain a mountain that was filled with volcano okay that uh, like the mountain like where volcanoes used to come out right like um like volcanoes f the place where a volcano emerges so they saw a volcanic mountain range dominating the horizon dominating means it was like covering almost all the horizon okay the far distance okay from the very far distance also they could see the volcanic mountain range and from there there were wispy smoke wispy means thin light smoke okay like uh that like whenever have you seen a volcano erupting like whenever there is a well whenever there is a volcano about take place first of all there would be smoke that would come out from the mountain so they could see this light thin smoke okay rising from the mountain from the peaks the runners now had to descend a 30 304 8 meter high sand dune at a 60 slope to continue with the race next thing again now now they have climbed uh, a steep like they have run this 9.6 kilometer on a climb on a steep like they were climbing high on a mountain now now their next part to run was to again they have to go down okay they have to go down that is 304.8 meter high sentience like sentience now you have seen sentience right so the runner had to run from the sentience down till down like uh which was like 304 meter okay at a 60 degree slope now the slope that was the the slope from the sand tune okay the slope that they were about to take it was 60 degree to continue with the rest for the last 26 kilometer of the day's run now the last 26 kilometer the remaining 26 kilometer to be run for the second day okay now see how many kilometers they are running in one day so the last 26 kilometer of the day's run stumpy running all along spotted just one tree so what happened when uh the last 26 kilometer was left for stumpy to run he was running all alone and during the during uh he was running and when he was running alone he could see that there was just one tree after running so many kilometers he had not seen even a single tree but finally when the last 26 kilometer was left finally he spotted one tree now here you can see the meaning of the words appreciate means praise rich means a narrow hilltop stretch means an expanse of land and water wispy means vague the one i told you okay vague means very light thin okay smoke okay